They say you getting it jack. I say I already got it. Only nigga from the set with 50 G's in his pocket. They say you winning jack. I said I don't need. Yo, life seemed like you know it was it was it was it was live. So, uh, but I looked at you. Your case was you you had an armed robbery. So. Yeah, when, how, did, how did how did <laughs> how did how did how did armed robbery become become in that thing become involved in man, your life? With me, right? You know, I'm, I'm I've been hustling since I was shorty. You know, paper routes, all that shit. You know, what I'm saying cans with my grandma and them doing all this shit. So I've been hustling. You said you right. right. You, you when I saw I selling dope and shit, I'm talking. About I'm hustling so hard, and I'm getting this money. You know what I'm saying? And I'm doing this and all this shit, man. And motherfuckers don't know, man. My old girl gave me a check to go flip. You know what I'm saying? And I just flip money to make sure we got shit in the crib, make sure we good. Right. You see what I'm saying? Now, through all this hustling and shit, you know, I was coming up. And when I started really coming up, going flipping shit on my own, you know what I'm saying? Oh, I was, I was on another level then. Right. You know what I'm saying? So I'm finna put the homies on and all this shit. You know what I'm saying? But niggas who I trusted in. So some shicey shit and all this shit, Fuck up man. The Fucking up shit. They ain't you had the same saying? drive. And right. They didn't exactly. See, they sight one like yours. Exactly. At a young age. They at a young it. age, they ain't they had it, man. You know and what I'm saying? You, because so I, I was young. Gee, you, I was, you, I was, you expected them to be like right, how you were, like and me. you couldn't figure it out that right, you like, avoid right. bands of your age. And right, that. and I ain't know. You, you ain't know. So now, as you got right. older, and as a young age, right. older motherfucker was looking up to me. Yeah, yeah. you see what I'm so saying? They didn't have it. Right, you know what I'm saying? I'm like, damn, you know what I'm saying? So I always been that pushed into a leader position without even knowing without even knowing and not ready for it cuz I, I you know I'm I'm a, I'm a I'm a nigga of the people man I'm with I'm with the homies I ain't trying to be bigger than the homies I'm trying to be right there with them so by you, you know what I'm by saying? you confide uh and, and, and provide and put your trust in your homies that caused for you to have a downfall right money exactly. wise but even even at that point it wasn't it wasn't so fucked up where I couldn't bounce back you know what I'm saying but it was just out kicking it with the homies. I'm gonna tell you, we was out kicking it with the homies and shit. We kicking it, riding around and shit. No, I want to know how did I'm you, tell you don't right know in your mind to even. I'm finna tell you. Okay. We out kicking it, you know what I'm saying? It's just snowing and all this shit outside. So we out riding around, kicking it, drinking and shit. And they ass was broke, broke. Now I wasn't broke, broke. I had a little something, you know what I'm saying? But I ain't had what I had. Right. You know what I'm saying? So we riding around, and they like, man. I should go rob this motherfucking store, man. And I'm like, man, y'all niggas just talking, you know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? He's like, no, nah, for real, we should go rob the other homie. We should go rob this motherfucker. <laughs> I'm like, man, y'all get the fuck out of that bullshit. You feel me? You know, I ain't no, I'm a hustler, nigga. I right. get money, you know what I'm saying? So they like, man, we finna go do it. So they parked the car like, all right, go in. Well, I'm thinking they bullshit. Niggas get out the car, grab the pistol. I give my pistol here. Yeah. You know, cause I think they bullshit here. Nigga, take the pistol. Do what you do. Nigga, I don't believe you, goof ass nigga. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? For real. You niggas ain't no no money. Like, you niggas ain't with me. Like, right. They thirsty. You know right, what I'm saying? Right. I'm sitting in the car drinking. They leave. You know, me and my cousin, we in there talking shit. These goof ass niggas. You know what I'm saying? But them niggas come running back with the bag. <laughs> take off. G, take off. We take off. I'm like, what the fuck? They like, yeah, nigga, I told you, nigga, them niggas got stacks. I'm like, God damn. Damn, damn y'all niggas. The light like, clicked right. on. They like, yeah, man, we just did an ugly leg. That's his leg, you know what I'm saying? So we ride, we we leave. We did that on the west side. So we go to North Chicago, you know, get out the vicinity, all that shit. And it's snowing real hard, so we ain't worried about the police getting on the nigga ass because they ain't finna, you know, right. in that snow and shit. So we riding. I'm tripping on these niggas. You know, my cousin, he thirsty as hell. You know what I'm saying? I'm sitting there. I'm like, you niggas crazy. But I'm still ain't with this shit. Right. You know what I'm saying? You niggas a fool. My cousin like, man. Cuz, man, let's go hit one. <laughs> I'm like, nigga, you, you playing. You ain't going to do shit. He's like, for real, give me the pistol. I go do it. 
You know what I'm saying? I'm like, man, my homie, they were like, go in. <laughs> <laughs> you see what we did? Right. They back there with stacks. So I'm like, all right, fuck it, come on, let's go see what it do, man. Y'all park Boy, around they, here. Yeah, he shit Man, <laughs> we went over there, hit a lick, Joe. What, in the North Chicago? <laughs> yeah. Went in that motherfucker. Bust this safe down, bitch. Woo, woo, woo. You know, we came about there with about 10 stacks. I'm like, oh, what? They like, oh, y'all hit the lick. Yeah, we hit the lick, man. We got up out of there. I'm like, oh, it's on. I'm back down. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? <laughs> Straight on, G. Damn, so and then, Ted Rack was a lot back hell then. Hell yeah, a lot, G. I'm talking about shit. Me and my cousin split that shit, man. Nigga went and bought him a car and everything. We went, you know, back down. G, you know what I'm saying? I'm going, so, you know, I'm going to do what I do best. So, you know, so, give me some so, dope and flip that shit. Okay, so, okay, y'all, you hit your lick. Right. But how did it become on the like, own thing? Yeah, like, it became that became... way because of they ass, really. It wasn't because of me, because I went and flip my shit and did what I, I went but back. But they I ass, they ain't down. no hustler, so they just fell right. off. They ain't no hustler. So now they, they fell off. like, man, let's go do what we so do. Now they like, man, man. And they on, dragging man. you in the Right. Head. Yeah, come on, man. Take me over, man. Let's go, man. We need to hit. Now, is they getting you is because you got the pistol <coughs> or the yeah, car? Yeah, because I got the pistol in the car. Oh, okay. So you they see what I'm saying? The boat. Right. So now they come to get me, and they know, you know, I'm a rider. They know how I get down. You know what I'm saying? So they coming, man. Come on, good man. I need this money, man. Please, man. Oh, um, alright. And me by my loyalty for niggas, man, and my love for niggas. You know what I'm saying? I don't like to see no nigga out there hurting and all that shit. You know what I'm saying? And I think that played a part in it, too. So you went on a few licks with these right, niggas? Right, yeah. So I went on a few licks with them, you know what I'm saying? Made sure motherfuckers was eating. You know what I'm saying? I even went on licks, and I ain't even had to go on the licks. You know what I'm saying? Because I was straight. Right, right. You feel right, me? Right. I didn't have to go on the licks with you niggas. You know what I'm saying? Right. But I did it, you know what I'm saying? So now it's just, that's just what it is. People do not, now, right. is, it known in the, is it known in the area that this this is y'all repertoire. No, so cause y'all ain't y'all ain't y'all ain't okay. Cause y'all ain't y'all ain't right. Y'all ain't jacking niggas in the hood. Y'all right. jacking stores. Y'all robbing we stores. We hit stores. We hit motherfuckers. We hit motherfuckers. Yeah, man. We hit niggas. Uh, we hit like 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 army motherfuckers. You know what I'm okay. saying? Okay. Yeah, we tan. You know the base was down the street. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We just hit motherfuckers, man. We just hit motherfuckers. Yeah, yeah, okay, you know what I'm okay. saying? So y'all ain't hitting. Right, they show boys. Show. Right, okay, we, okay, we okay, ain't okay, doing okay. that, you know. What I'm so saying? nobody knows y'all doing this, but y'all. Right. Don't nobody know. And and, and 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 the police like somebody is is going yeah, crazy. Somebody in the area. licking motherfuckers, but all the time, you know, we wasn't showcasing that shit. We just on the set chilling. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? And you know me. I, so I'm what, what 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 part of time? No, when you was y'all hot when you got caught, or was it just a sloppy job to make y'all get caught? It was a, bringing in new motherfuckers. That's what it was. A motherfucker that wasn't even from the area, a motherfucker that ain't no shit, a motherfucker that was, you know what I'm saying? So, and so, like, and then he got y'all got caught on the spot or got caught later yeah, on? Yeah, we got caught later on, but he got caught on the spot. And told about everything. Right, you see what I'm saying? That's how that shit went. So, so this person that y'all brought in, how did y'all meet this person? My cousin and knew this nigga already. They, they, you know, it's a nigga. And he brought, from, it was good. a nigga from down south. And he brought y'all. He brought him around y'all. You know what I'm to saying? To the house, yeah, going around y'all. Come around, yeah. yeah. You know what I'm saying? So that's a, how he knew it everything. It was one of them things. You know what I'm saying? So, and, so was he around a long time before the lick happened, or how no, long he was he around? around that long, man? You know what I'm saying? But my cousin, you know, this one bet I trust this nigga. Ooh, all right, yeah, all this shit. You know what I'm saying? All right, go do what you do. You know what I'm saying? So and that's how that shit went down. And he got the lesser time. Yeah, he got out. He oh, he didn't no even do time. time. He didn't do no time. So I mean, they put all that shit on me because you was basically leader. Had everything. everything. I was the leader of the woo yeah, yeah. out the, here. The I was, car, they go to I was for the, the man. You, you know the, what I'm saying? Got the and all this and shit. All that. Yeah, they put all that. You on know what I'm saying? I'm known nigga in the hood, and you know what I'm saying, and all this other shit. So when that happened, and 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 all that, how did that? I mean, was that the first time? That people told on you when you got in trouble with the law enforcement like that? No, that wasn't the first time. So it wasn't you know a saying? surprise? No, it wasn't no surprise. It wasn't, sure. a, but it was a surprise from the motherfucker who was coming from. You know what I'm saying? Because it was more than him, you know what I'm saying? So that was the surprise, you feel me? And how did that... But at the time, now I've been told on before by homies, you know what I'm saying? That's supposed to have been homies 
<laughs> so so you know it happened. Hold on them up. So you know that that does happen. Right, exactly. You know it what just saying? hurt when it really do hit home. Right, exactly. Especially so when it's somebody you you know. Okay, so so so, so now you you, you 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 get all this. You got this this outsider bring y'all down, and you 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 locked up at the beginning, and you right. you feeling all this. Did that make your beginning of your bit like angry? The beginning part. In the beginning, I was I was I was salty at all them niggas. You know what I'm saying? <clears throat> you know what I'm saying? I'm talking about as far as you know. It was only one of my homies, man, that I wasn't salty at. You know what I'm saying? And why was that? He stood ten toes down. You know what I'm saying? But the rest of them niggas, man, I was man, I wanted to kill them niggas. You feel me? I ain't gonna even lie, man. They they hurt the nigga hard. So you when did when did that 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 kill leave from out? You? Well, that left like shit. I think about five years before I got out. Oh, so it took 15, 20 years before. Yeah, yeah, before that shit left. Before that shit left. Because I'm talking wow. about I had it in my mind. I so that's, that's. Touch down, nigga. Right. I'm on y'all ass. So you that's know what just to tell you. So that's how you know. Not to, to you know. You know, we, 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 we trying, like I say, we trying to get peace and everything. Right. right. It take, and, you know, and it just goes to show you how long it. The work process will have to take yeah. sometimes. You know hey, what I'm man, saying? That shit, man, that and sometimes shit longer than that, but you got to put in the work. Right. Exactly. You got to put, you gotta in, put the in the work. Man. But you know back to so <clears throat> now you at the beginning of the bit. Right. And this is the serious shit now. So when did you in your mind know like damn this is some serious shit? Man, I, I knew it was some serious shit through the door, right? You know what I'm saying? But I'm talking about like but, when it set in, like, oh shit, these motherfuckers are so -so. The fuck is they on? Like, <laughs> in court type. Nigga. Right, right. Oh, yeah, they tried it. Man, I'm like, damn. Because at first, they wasn't really aimed at me like that. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Because I was the youngest nigga out of everybody. Mm -hmm. You see what I'm saying? I was the youngest. So they couldn't believe, like, right, the, the youngest nigga. You know what I'm saying? It's the mastermind. the mastermind. You know what I'm saying? And then they started hearing all the shit I was doing in the hood, who I was, and all that shit. And that shit flipped. But they came at me first. Man, go and testify against Woo Woo. You know what I'm saying? And we'll give you a slap on the back because you ain't really got no record. You ain't really, you know what I'm saying, out there like that. You the youngest. We know these niggas been to jail before, been locked up in the joint before. You ain't been through that shit. Go on and rat on. Right. So go on and tell them and we'll hit you on the wrist and that's it. And I told them, no, nah, I ain't going to be able to do that when you feel me. So they like, okay, cool. You ain't going to be able to do it. No, I ain't going to be able to do it. So they say, okay, cool. Fuck it. They left me alone. And went and hollered at them niggas. And they like, all right, and them niggas like, okay, cool. I got you. Then they came back to me like, okay, now we finna give you 80 years. 80? What the fuck? What the fuck is you talking about 80 years? <laughs> you motherfuckers tripping. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> yeah. Yeah, so that's how I turned to be there. I'm like, oh, yeah, this is serious. Now, these bitches ain't playing. Because I'm thinking in my head, I'm like, okay, cool. You know, they ain't finna give me nothing. They ain't finna slap me with like, Three years, I do like six months or a year. Get the fuck back. That's out. how your mind frame is. Come back out, swole. You know. So that's how your it. mind frame. Come back down. You feel me? So that's the mind frame. Right. That's the mind frame. You know what I'm saying? Wow. So they come, my fuck come with eighty. So eighty. Fuck. So when you left there in that eighty still, and you went and you leaving, how how was that in your head? Man, that shit had me fucked up. Dude. I'm like, eighty. You fucking serious? told the motherfuckers, I came back to the deck, I'm like, man, you ain't gonna believe this shit. You know what I'm saying? I'm hollering at the guys because, you know, I had the deck up in there too. So did anybody so, think it was gonna be that serious? Did anybody be like, when they know your case, y'all be, you know how motherfuckers talk right, about right, cases right. and shit, you know the yeah, guys. Yeah, motherfuckers so like, motherfuckers, like, like motherfuckers they think it's gonna be that serious, but it was election year, all type of political shit going on. Right, right, But right. ain't nobody really think it was gonna be that serious. Motherfuckers like, man, the most you might get is like 10 years, if you get that. You know what I'm saying? We looking at you to get like three to five years. Right, 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 right. Do about right. a year or two, you know, because we got half and half. So do about a year or two and come on to the creek. So ain't nobody, nobody think, okay. Yeah, okay. nobody think that shit. So when right you coming there. back and everybody like, man. I tell them that shit. They like, man, no, nah, they just trying to get at you, man. They just trying to scare you to tell and all this shit and all that shit, right? You know what I'm saying? But then once they start, we start, first we was going to court to get all of then when that shit happened, they separate each other. Then they separate my I'm like, what the fuck? I knew right there, I was like, oh shit, somebody is this, this shit getting they real now. 
You so know what I'm saying? So did you go then that they was telling you still didn't know? You still wasn't trying to cope that they right, I wasn't you. trying to cope until that separation shit. Once that separation shit happened, then I knew. I said, oh, man, these niggas finna tell on me, man. You know what I'm saying? Motherfuckers finna testify on me and shit. Then that's when they start coming with them outrageous numbers and shit. But we'll give you 56 years. We'll give you, we'll give you 45 years. When you get out, you'll be half your life. You'll be good and all this shit. Go on, cop out for 40. No, oh, man, I'm not copping out for shit. Fuck what you talking about? Y'all might well stack the deck, man. We going to the, we going, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> but, man, you know, co-defendants didn't feel the same way and shit, so. We went to trial. Niggas came and told on me and all that sitting in my face. Yeah, that's it right there. Damn. So how Damn, did that feel? That how right did that there, feel? That felt fucked up. So no, I'm like the like, closest homies shit. to Man, wow. blood, nigga. Cousin. You they know don't understand and just point you there out. There you go right there. Yeah, that's them. You know, we woo up the damn damn, nigga. Wow. That's what this shit didn't boil down to. You know? Wow. And I'm sitting there. So you know did the family treat your yeah. cousin differently? Yeah, they was mad, man. They was salty. You know what I'm saying? They was mad than a motherfucker. You know what I'm saying? Like, nigga, you serious? You finna get out on, on cuz like that? Or the, even they the homie, even they homie, nigga, see, you serious? You so finna get out on G like that? Yeah, they, so you know people saying? actually came to see that they yeah. do. Cause wow. you know, motherfucker, you know. People say this know. and hear this, but they got to see the real. Right, you know right, what I'm saying? And right. then a lot of motherfuckers cared about me, so you know a lot of motherfuckers. Yeah, you had a lot of love. You know, had right. a lot of love. Exactly, so motherfucker was there like, man, damn. What? They really yeah. getting down on G like this? You yeah. know what I'm saying? And yeah, G, they got down on So, so, man. so, okay. Obviously, by all that, they found you guilty. They found so me they, guilty. So, so, what they, they find uh, you guilty of? What was the charge they found you guilty of? Armed robbery, uh, attempt, armed robbery. So they gave me armed robbery, attempt kidnapping, what? Another armed robbery. What they gave me? Two armed robbery, kidnapping, and attempt. And they gave you how much time? They gave me 35 years. They gave me 25. They gave me 25 and two tens. They ran that shit. They ran the two tens together. And wow. And 25 wow with the and two the 10 tens. was wow. Wow. So they gave me 35 years all together. So when they gave you the 35 years and you said, what the fuck? Man, what the fuck? It was, it was, man, but you know, I'm, I'm going to tell you. They gave me the 35 years and I got sins right. I heard, I hear, I'm hearing what he's saying. He's talking this shit, woo, up and then, well, I give you this, I give you that, I give you this. But that shit ain't registering, you know what I'm saying? I'm just looking at his lips move. You feel me? So when I leave, I go back in the bullpen. I get in the bullpen, ain't nobody in this motherfucker. Just me. I walk in that shit. And that silence came again. You know what I'm saying? It was silent. You feel me? And I'm just sitting in that motherfucker. Nah, it's just locked. And the shit is not registering, you know what I'm saying? And I'm just thinking like, you feel me? The fuck? This shit just happened? It was like an out of body experience, you feel me? Facts. But I couldn't even register the shit. Yeah, right, it's too big. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, it's like yeah. an out of body, I'm just sitting there like all oh, nonchalant and shit. Like, man, this shit tripping, you know what I'm so, saying? So, so when it, when, it when, 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 when did it, when did it register like that? It is what it is. It's on. It's on. I think it registered when I, um, probably, probably that night, man. That night and shit, you know what I'm saying? When I really, when he came up there and hollered at me like, yeah, man, they gave you 25 to 10 and then you got 35. You got The to lawyer? Do, yeah, you got to do this much time. You got to woo, 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 woo. And I'm like, damn. You know what I'm saying? So I get on the phone, but later that night, it was like, nigga. You finna go to the joint, nigga, for a minute. <laughs> you know what I'm saying, nigga? <laughs> get your shit right. Get ready, nigga. It's on. You got to get in mode, nigga. So it's on. When you everything else is out the window. You when know what I'm saying? What joint did you? What they sent you to when you first got to the joint? Pontiac. You know they sent Pontiac. we build excitement, maximum security, nigga. 
the worst motherfucker in the, in the system. So when you heard Boom. she was going right to Pontiac, back in that motherfucker. when you heard she was going to Pontiac, by yeah. you hearing the stories, what is what is it, what is it register in your head? But now, I'm gonna tell you the truth, right? I knew I was going to Pontiac. Right. I knew I was going to Pontiac. Look, oh. I'm gonna tell you this here. I could have even, you know how they say, you know how they say, um, the things you say out your mouth might come true. You know what I'm saying? Or what you think might come true. Oh, you must have already been. Already on the set. You know how both the Big Mo and them should call the crib. I mean, uh, yeah. Big, and Big Mo called me like, man, I'm down there in Pontiac, G-Woo, I've been being, I thought they were from the gangster shit ever. And I used to always joke and say, man, I'm going to go to Pontiac, get swole, you know what I'm saying, grow my butters, get swole, come back out, nigga. And I used to always so say that. So you kind of spoke it to existence. I kind of spoke it to existence. So, okay. You know Let me saying? rewind it. When you got to 35 years and you hang back to the deck. Right. How did the guys on the deck react to you getting that sentence? They was like, damn. For dude. them thinking that you was only going to get right. 10 years yeah, at exactly. the most. They, was, they was probably was more fucked up than me. They couldn't believe it. They couldn't believe it, G. They like, damn, they gave you 35 years, G. Damn, they was they was more fucked up than me. Yeah, because they didn't get it. it hit right. You. Yeah, 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 they hit me. Yeah, you know yeah. what I'm saying? It, it was like that with me, man. Right. When I had got my um, I had got an eight, but when I got that twelve, it was the same way. When I got twelve years, and then yeah, you know what I'm saying? It didn't, it didn't, it didn't, it didn't, it didn't really hit me Again, like that. The niggas on the deck know. was like, damn, <laughs> right? Twelve, but then what I was facing, they kind of figured like got kind of good. Yeah, you got kind of off a little bit. But you, but it was, it's kind of different. Right, but right, you right. Th but everybody thought 10 at the most, but then right. they went over, double, right. triple time, you know what I mean? So, they was like, so by you hitting, by you knowing like, oh yeah, I'm, I'm ready for this anyway. Right. So you hit Pontiac. Right. Was it what you thought in your head? Pontiac? Yeah. Yeah, it was. It was, it was, it was, you know what I'm saying? It was everything I'm talking about. Was, I stepped in that motherfucker. I ain't gonna lie, I stepped in that bitch. That bitch was just like the set. I'm telling you, G. I was, I was like, oh shit, I'm good. This thing, I'm good. I'm here. So, uh, so, you know so, what I'm saying? So basically, when you got to the yak, right. you saying there was a whole bunch of niggas in there like set niggas. Exactly, G, a whole bunch of set niggas and niggas. I'm talking about I walk through the door, niggas over there shooting dice and shit. Motherfuckers sitting on the music bumping. Motherfuckers out here kicking everybody gang banging, hats broke off and shit. I'm like, oh, what the fuck? Oh, send me to the project, nigga. It's on. I'm and in then you look at all the tears. Right, I'm looking like, at the motherfucking tears. Every, like, every tear doing I'm that. I'm the motherfucker walking, kicking it and shit. I'm like, oh, it's on. It's on in this bitch. You know what I'm saying? So, <laughs> like, and, and so from then on out, it was just it was man, on and popping. So and poppin', how did dude. you turn of <laughs> out, out of out of 35, you're supposed to only do... <laughs> Like, 15, 17, yeah, exactly. how did you turn a 17-year bitch to <laughs> 20, a 25-year bitch? Hey, gee, about doing crazy <laughs> shit, gee, I'm talking about, I went down there with this this thought in my head, man. I said, look, I'm going to put all that shit, street shit, you know what I'm saying, all that shit going to be there, you know what I'm saying? I ain't going to really dwell on that shit too much. You know what I'm saying? I'm in this motherfucker now. You know what I'm saying? And I'm finna, I'm finna, man, I'm finna play this motherfucker. I'm finna be the gangster I am. You know what I'm saying? Ten times over. You get, you know what I'm saying? And, and and that's how I played it, man. Motherfucker, get out of line. I'm on your ass. You know what I'm saying? I ain't finna give no nigga no chance on no shit. You know what I'm saying? And I'm standing on my business. You feel me? So by me doing that, you know, I got into fights, whooping motherfuckers, whooping police. Catching time, you know what I'm saying? I had 50 shanks, you know what I'm saying? And I was still getting drunk and all that shit. You so, know, so shanks, that shit. For, shanks is, is nice for the yeah, people. Nice, yeah, okay, nice. so, okay, um, now, now, how did your mom and sister them feel? Were they scared for you? And, um, how can I say? 
Oh, like but I they said, knew how like you I was. Said, yeah, like I said, you know, motherfuckers they always. They knew how you was. They yeah, knew yeah, that everybody you. Everybody always knew. Oh, this nigga be able to take care of himself wherever the fuck he go. So they basically, you know? basically <laughs> everybody knew that. Right, everybody knew. You had Pontiac oh, in. Oh, yeah, he gonna be straight. They yeah, basically knew you right. had Pontiac in. Right, basically. you know what I'm saying? Okay. He gonna be straight. So you know we, we let yeah. everybody know. They knew right, this they nigga knew. was a Pontiac baby. Right. And he was. <laughs> He was gonna go through, gonna go through the yak. That's what he was gonna go through the yak. And they was right. And they was right. They was right. They was right. I'm talking about Bang was down there. I'm talking about them niggas. Look, you know, legends like Wayne Bang made rest in peace. You rest know in peace, Bang. AB all, you know, AB was down there. Them niggas used to have to, you used to have to calm me down. You down Man, there. man, be cool, man. What did you down? You ain't gonna never get out, G. <laughs> I'm like, gee, fuck these niggas. You know what I'm saying, nigga? It's on in this bitch. I'm in it. You know what I'm saying? You feel me? You know <laughs> we what, had G? OGs down there, big rushes now. You know what I'm saying? They loved you, though. Right. You wild. They was calming me. Like, man, gee. They, but, but they, like they, they, old they niggas, man, man. them niggas love the shit out of me. They love man. the wild I'm niggas. I'm talking about, I was. Energy, you and you feel was me? part of the I UFO, so yeah, yeah, I was gonna, yeah, the definitely, UFO is definitely, the hit squad. Definitely for the guys. Man, definitely. People don't know. Definitely. You was on the UFO squad and by you being on the UFO squad, how did that affect the multitude by you just being around? Ooh, Not just on geez. the hit, just just well, being you, UFO just being around. Staff, I always wanted to be being, 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 being just shit. your status. Like right. when they just see you. Man, I'm talking about Z. You couldn't even really come around the guys like you wanted. Like I told you, man, I was a, I was a, 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 a people's person, a guys person. No, exactly. I wanted to That's be with what I'm the saying. Guys. Right, right. But when I got on that, I'm talking. About, I come around niggas be like. Man, quiet and shit, G, what you want, G, you know what I'm saying? They, they, they either, if I'm coming around, either I'm coming to fuck you up right. or coming to do some other shit, right. you know what I'm saying? Because so, that was my job, right. you know what I mean? <laughs> so when so I came to kick, kick it, right, it, when I came to kick it, they like, like, oh, this nigga, man. G, man, so what did you want, did that, did that make you, did that, uh... Give you a high, or did they make you be like, no, nah, you ain't on that? Yeah, or, they yeah no, that kind of fucked me up, Yeah, man, you ain't wanted like, to be like... Right, because yeah, yeah. it was like I was isolated. Because that's like, you. That's right, who you exactly. are. You that's are already a people person. Right, I'm a people person. They was isolated. Like, See, they people got to understand. Like, oh, no, people man, got to understand. Me, I just had to do what I business had to do. Business is business and friendship right. is something personal. Business is business, man. You know what I'm saying? So... That's what they, baby separated life. I got to get on your. We can be homies and kick it off. If I got to get on your ass, I'm on your ass. It's business, man. It ain't no personal shit. TP, you know but that's how the guys was. They right. they, exactly. they they deliberately, deliberately make your best be, homie deliberately get down on them. Deliberately, you know what I'm saying? Deliberately, for real on everything. That this is not for no real. made up ain't shit. No made up. They shit. deliberately. Ain't no man you fuck cool, up. And he fuck you want all y'all in the fuck up. They going to get your guy. Okay, go in there and fuck him up, man. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? That shit was good. That shit, to me, that was a good strategy. I ain't going to lie. Because mm -hmm. it broke a lot of that. You know what I'm saying? And what they also did, if you hated this nigga, one of the guys, y'all can't get along. Yeah. Y'all finna be tired every Real, day. Every day. With each other. Oh, y'all don't like each other. Okay, y'all finna kick it with each other every, every day. Every day. You know what I'm saying? Until y'all get to love <laughs> each other. For real, though, that thing. On that thing. And that's See, today. I'm going to keep 100. Uh, I was listening to, uh, I don't know a lot of people, not to not to, not to bring nobody up, right. disrespect the, uh, the interview, but a lot of people don't listen to Charleston White, but yeah. I, I listened to him. He be saying some shit yeah, to me. he be saying some real shit. And he said that uh, the, I forget what he said, but he said, some pe some somebody in high power need to use Larry's right. ideology right. exactly. as they the do, whole. Man. Because that shit, like he said, man, he said he read that it taught him how to be a man. He and stole that, it. Right, he stole Actually, it. stole it from he, one of his cellies that right. was one of the guys. And he read and it. And he kept it and read it when he was supposed to. And he said that shit, and he said him, that shit changed his whole, whole motherfucking life. life. Now, he's a, originally supposed to be in the crib. Right. Now, just think about us. We living up under this either umbrella. So exactly. look how much it changed our life. Exactly. And we living it today. Every day is growth in the belly. Every day, man. You know this what is saying? my first time 
every day. Given the opportunity to do what I'm doing to interview my man right, right. here. Exactly. This is a growth and development and opportunity. And I love it. You know, <laughs> you know what I'm saying? And for real. And I'm going to get back to the interview because this, you, got an, you got a very interesting story because you, you went through all elements as a very young man, black man, right. can go through. You've seen it all. You've seen um, um, beings afraid to harm people. Right. You know exactly. what I'm saying? Exactly. You've seen the Holy Spirit. Right. You've seen uh, 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 the love story with the girl. Right. And wrote and, right. and, 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 and the love of hip hop, how you express right. your love through hip hop. You seen the lot on how you been as a child. Right. Exactly. Your sculpture as you know is very interesting. You know, right. a lot of people don't go through these things at all. Especially now today, these kids don't go right. outside anymore. Exactly. They, don't do they just that, sit man. in the house and just be on social media and just look without no activity. Right. You know what I mean? Without exactly. doing you know what I mean? They right. mad, they don't that's how you think. They think they can just go out and just do everything because they didn't watch this so much. Without right. no practice. No, you know, practice makes don't perfect. Like that, so, man. your story is very interesting. And, 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 okay, so, now you in the penitentiary. You, right. it's like it's like home. It's like the projects. You, oh, hell yeah. People calm you down. You in it. You like, you know, you don't give a fuck. You lose right. the time. You got bangers and shit. So, when did it cross over in your mind to where, damn, these niggas is right. If I keep moving like this, I ain't going to go to the crib. Right. What point of the it, bit it did it like, cross man. over to you like that? I say, I say, uh, you know, I had kicked off the ride down there, went through the walls, all type of shit. Okay, you know let's go back to that. And, 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 how know, did the riot? How did the riot kick off? I know you spoke about that in one of your other yeah, podcasts. Yeah, but podcast, say, uh, uh, do a quick draft on how did that riot kick all off? Right, I'm saying, you know, well, I went to Seg in the first place. Me and the folks beat up a motherfucker in the kitchen. We beat up the supervisors, the police, and shit. They put me in Seg, and during that time, I ended up in Seg for five years straight. You know what I'm saying? Because I caught I called other time and all this shit. But how the ride kicked off and shit, <clears throat> one of the guys got into it with the Lad King. Police shot the Lad King in the head. The joint went up. You know what I'm saying? Everybody was against the police. You know what I'm saying? So at this point, I was in the back of SIG. I had it for SIG. And my whole mode was, can't no police walk on this gallery. We fucking them up. You know what I'm saying? And I had riders with me. You know what I'm saying? So... Soon as they came on, we fucking them up. You know what I'm saying? And we sending it up every chance we get. You know what I'm saying? We tan their ass up. So y'all had a green light on the police, 12, on, the police. on all galleries, sanctioned right. by you right. and said. Right. So that's how it all kicked off. Exactly. Now, fast forward. Doing all that, you've been through all that. When was the time you was like, man, I got to, I got to try oh, to start man. getting home? I'm gonna tell you, after that, after that ride shit happened, they, they kicked me out this joint, sent me to other joints, you know what I'm saying? And I ended up in Menard. But when I get to Menard, you know what I'm saying? I go Menard down, is a whole different story. Whole different story. I go down there with the same mentality now how, though. How is Menard a whole different story from Pontiac? Because Menard is ran by white people. You know what I'm saying? That motherfucking joint is racist as fuck. All you got all the bikers, all the North Siders, all them Ku Klux Klan motherfuckers, skinheads, they run that bitch. You know what I'm saying? And when niggas come So that's down, headquarters for them. That's headquarters for them. You know what I'm saying? So when I step in this motherfucker, it's a whole different scene. You know what I'm saying? When I when I get there, they already know who the fuck I am, the police, everybody. So they at me through the door, you know what I'm saying? And I come through the door. Tearing shit up, cause I, I got it in my mind, nigga. The the ride ain't over with, nigga. Wherever I go, nigga, it's on. It's on. You know what I'm so saying? Like, so I come through the door like that, tearing shit up. You know what I'm saying? And when I get down there, man, I'm talking about this joint was so fucked up, but it was good at the same time. You what you mean? Man? Explain. As far as that, uh, it was so fucked up on the way that the administration had that motherfucker. With them white boys and all that shit going against niggas and all this shit. But it was good at the same time because niggas had to stick together more. Meaning the gangs. You know what I'm saying? The gangs. You know what I'm saying? So so by y'all being in a 
predominant white racist facility. Right. All gangs of color had to stick together. They had to stick together at one point in time. Now we get we still get into it sometimes, but we always on point. You know what I'm saying with these motherfucking people. You know what I'm saying because it because the, the administration. The motherfucking CEOs from the world. They, the they all ride with the North Side. They all ride with them. They'll let the motherfuckers in your cell to kill you. They'll put you outside on the yard by yourself and let 10 of them out there to get you. You see what I'm saying? So you had to be on point. You know what I'm saying? You had to be on point. So is that, is that, is that around the time where the guys, uh, is that around the time when the buddy buddy system came about? Yeah. Where you always had one of the, always have had to have one of the guys. Buddy system you? came before that though, you know what I'm saying? But but, but, but really, I think it that's the reason why it came. From Menard. Right. Because that's they what had I'm a ride because they had a ride before that. You know what I'm saying? Okay. Before I got down there. So what you what you wasn't in, that, that was probably at seventeen ride. You yeah, wasn't in that one though. No, I wasn't in that one. I right. was in the other one after that. Oh, one okay. After that. Okay, okay. So you wasn't in the the Pontiac seventeen was before you. Yeah, that was before me. Okay, okay. That was right okay. before I got there. Everybody down. know about the Pontiac 17, seventeen. You know what I mean? They sent that motherfucker up to go the whole joint. Yeah, shit up, seventeen deaths, man. You hear what I'm saying? So you know what I'm saying? So we all got down there right after that. You know what I'm saying? Okay, so but in Menard, when I got to Menard, man, like I said, it was a whole different ball game, you know. So you got to play a whole different game. You got to be on some whole different gangster shit down there. You know what I'm saying? But as I was going through there, it got to a point where I'm say as I started getting older, this would really change me a little bit when I got some pictures from home. You know what I'm saying? I got some pictures from my uh, auntie, from my family now, and I'm looking through the pictures and shit. Because I had I had stopped counting the years, I had stopped counting the days, I had stopped counting all that shit. You living like in the wilderness. Exactly. I'm you in the joint, up. nigga. You switched everything. Everything. Up. I'm you, in the joint, in nigga. That's what it is. Now that's powerful. What you're saying, right? Because to be able to do that. Yeah, you you have to have how some, old I was. Listen, you have to have an inner. That's why you was always going to those uh, Holy Spirit like stages, as you were right, saying. Right, exactly. Like, because you, it's some people who can't go a date without calling a damn girl. Exactly, man. They can't go a date. I done seen niggas hang themselves. Y'all seen because, a nigga. Went in Menard, clammed all the way up to the motherfucking tent jumped Gary, the and chair? jumped off that motherfucker and killed himself because his girl. Damn, I seen a nigga hang himself because his girl, yeah, bro. Yeah, I seen two For niggas real. do that. He didn't, he didn't die immediately, but he was brain dead, so they ended up right. having to pull the plug because, you know, he, he right. hung himself, bro. Exactly. Like, let's shit see it. So, Serious. Wow. So, okay. Now, you, you get these pictures. Right. And now the human being switched kick on like damn I am somebody's right. child and right. I am love. Well it, it switched on at this point. This way it switched on that. When I got the pictures, I'm looking through the pictures right now. Before I got locked up, my auntie had a baby. A little girl, a little baby girl, you know what I'm saying? I just sit there with the little baby, you know what I'm saying? And this was before I got locked up. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Now, when she sent me the pictures, it's like four more kids in that motherfucker. <laughs> and three of them hugged. <laughs> So I'm looking like, I'm like, who the fuck is this? Right? I'm like, man, who the fuck is this shit? You know what I'm saying? So when I see the motherfucking picture, I'm looking, I'm like, man, who is this? Who is this? Who is this? Right? So I call the crib, like, man, who is this on this picture? She's like, man, that's my baby girl. Now the, the shorty was like 17. Shorty was like, <laughs> you know, 15, yeah. 16. You know what I'm saying? I'm like, it's like a grown little, you know, this your motherfucker, this the baby that I used I to watch. Up, yeah. Yeah, ah, hell. Then that's when I said, okay, er, how long you been locked up, nigga? I got to count on my hand. Hold up, one, two, three. Oh, I got to go back now. Damn. <coughs> and then so, I counted the years up. And I was like, damn, I got to do how many years? So let Shit, me, I'm almost, man, I'm, I'm almost over the hump. So hold on. You know what I'm saying? So, let, no, hold on, Wait, hold on. You mean to tell me that it was so... You made it to, it was so action packed. Right. To where you didn't even know the calendars was flipping as they was flipping. I ain't even know it, G. You know what I'm saying? Wow. I ain't even know I was locked up that damn long. 
what I'm saying? So did you, did you, when did you? When it really registered, one of the guys, one of the old time, I'm sitting there kicking with the old time, we playing chess and shit. You know what I'm saying? He like, he like, man, shorty. I had got into it. Well, I ain't get into it. One of the guys got into it. was a skinnyhead motherfucker, right? So you know me. Nigga, we on the yard, nigga. You know, I'm on the skinnyhead ass. Bitch, we finna kill your punk ass. You know what I'm saying? You can catch you on this job. We finna tear your ass up. You know, so we, hey, I'm on that. So the old time, he's like, man, shorty. So, why not to cut you off. Okay. Are the skinheads the most disrespectful gangs you done ran into in the penitentiary? Mm -hmm. Nah. They say you're getting it checked. I say I already got it. Only nigga from the set with 50 G's in his pocket. They say you're winning, Jack. I said I don't.